The Atmos 2000, autonomous truck-mounted howitzer system, self-propelled gun howitzer was developed by Soltam as a private venture. Later this company became a part of Elbit Systems. Existence of this Israeli artillery system was revealed in 1999. However official details were released only in 2001. This howitzer was aimed mainly at the export market. In 2003 an undisclosed export customer ordered an undisclosed number of these artillery systems. In 2006 the Atmos 2000 began trials with the Israel Defense Forces. In 2013 deliveries commenced to Thailand. In 2016 this artillery system has been spotted in Rwanda. The Atmos 2000 is armed with a 155mm L52 gun howitzer. It was developed from the Soltam Athos 2052 towed howitzer, equipped with a load assisting system. It is compatible with all standard 155mm NATO ammunition. Maximum range of fire is 30 km with standard HE projectile and 41 km with extended range projectile, and 56 km with newly developed rocket assisted projectile. This artillery system carries a total of 32 projectiles and associated charges. Rate of fire is between 4 and 9 rounds per minute. The Atmos 2000 is also available with different guns, including a shorter Sultan 155mm L39 and 155mm L45 guns. Depending on customer requirement this artillery system can also be fitted with a Soviet M46 130mm gun. Advanced fire control system of the Atmos 2000 receives target information from forward observers. It includes navigation and aiming systems and ballistic computer. Vehicle is normally operated by a crew of four, including two loaders. Cab of the Atmos 2000 is armored and protects the crew from small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. The Atmos 2000 uses Tatra T815 VV and 6x6 truck chassis. Vehicle is powered by a diesel engine, developing 315 horsepower. An auxiliary power unit is fitted, which prepares vehicle for firing, operates weapon elevation and traverse and powers the load assisting system when the main engine is shut down. Howitzer can be operated manually in case of emergency. This artillery system can be airlifted with a C-130 Hercules tactical transport aircraft. The Atmos has been demonstrated implemented on 8x8 trucks. However this version receives no production orders so far. Variants Atmos for the Thai Army has a number of improvements. It was developed in cooperation with Thailand's military industrial complex. Its development commenced in 2012 and this truck-mounted howitzer was revealed in 2013. This artillery system has a shorter 155mm L39 gun. It is fitted with an armored cab. Many of the gun systems are automated. It is operated by a crew of three or four men. The name Atmos 2000 was no longer used and the new howitzer was simply known as Atmos. It was planned that this Thai version of the Atmos will be license produced in Thailand. However Thai army requirement was only for six of these howitzer. It was planned that first five artillery systems of Thai origin will be delivered by 2016. Atrum, Romanian variant of the Atmos 2000, mounted on a locally developed 6x6 truck chassis. This artillery system received no production orders. KRYL is a Polish truck-mounted howitzer, which is fitted with an ordnance of the Atmos 2000, mounted on a Jelks 6x6 truck chassis. It was first unveiled to the public in 2014.